Hey guys, my name is Costa, and today I'm gonna show you how to create these animated icons in Framer. So I got a hero section and inside I got a title and an image. I will select the first icon, press Ctrl Alt Enter to add a stack, go to position and size and change to fit content for the width and fit content for the height. Do the same with the second icon, press Ctrl Alt Enter, change from fixed to fit content. I will select both of them and as you can see right now, the stacks are cutting off the edges of the icons. So I will go to overflow and switch from hidden to visible. Now looks good. Press Ctrl X and paste the icons inside the hero section. Right now they have a position of relative, so I will switch to absolute. Let's select the first stack and move it up and to the left. This looks good. I will select the second stack, move it down and to the right. All right, now make sure that you pin them to the right and not to the left. If it's to the left, they will not be uh, responsive. So I will select the second icon and this one is pinned correctly. Okay, now let's go to mobile. Right now they are way too big, so I will make them smaller. And this one smaller as well. All right, next I will select the first icon. Go to Effects, Loop, click on Mirror, in the Rotate field type in 0 and then in the Y Offset field type in minus 100 maybe. Then right here it says Transition, so I will click on the Linear, switch to Ease, In and Out and then for the time I will type in maybe 4 seconds. Right click and copy this effect, go to the second icon Go to Effects, Loop, and now all you have to do is right click and paste the effect, uh, which is gonna be the same like this one. But for this one, I would like actually to have a 100 uh, instead of negative 100. And voila guys, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.